Beit Sherim is a city in Lower Galilee from Roman times. After the destruction of Jerusalem in 70 AD, it became the center of Jewish culture. Despite the fact that the necropolis of Beit Sherim is well studied, the catacombs with this grave were discovered only recently and absolutely accidentally. They turned out to be part of a complex of interconnected burial caves. In this burial place, which is almost 2,000 years old, rests a certain Jacob the Prosolyte, a Jewish convert. Next to his burial niche was a limestone slab with a curse in Greek leaning against the cave wall. This text, written in red paint resembling blood, was meant to deter grave robbers. Jacob the proselyte swears that anyone who opens this grave will be cursed. He was 60, the slab reads. Scholars note that in ancient Rome, it was common for people to compose inscriptions on their own tombstones, although this was not typical for Israel. Nevertheless, the inscription was probably made by Jacob himself. There is a thick red line under it, under which another person has marked 60 years, probably indicating Jacob's age. In Beit Sheerim it was customary to bury Jews from all over the East, so it is impossible to say exactly where Jacob came from, especially since his body is not in the grave. Despite the threat, it was opened by burglars, and apparently a long time ago. Meanwhile, the builders of the tomb of the first Chinese emperor, Qin Shi Huangdi, preferred to ensure the safety of the ruler's body and the amazing treasures buried with him not with threatening inscriptions, but with mercury traps. We told about the terrible fate of the robbers who ventured into the tomb on our channel.